good morning children hope you liked yesterday's activity okay now should we proceed today further with the next topic so look here today our topic is international place value chart now till today children we uh, we had done we were doing place value only but we have whatever uh, number name then arranging number comparison of number understanding number whatever we have done we have done according to indian place value chart today the same thing we will repeat but it will be according to international place value chart so indian place value chart we have done in previous class also in grade 4 and we did it in grade 5 also now but only the period of crore increase in our indian place value but this is totally new topic for you now so let's see what all things are there here periods places place values all are same in indian as well as in international so now which are the periods let's see so the here we will proceed from the right side once it is same as indian place value chart then thousands same as indian place value chart but here no lakh no crore this because is millions so the third this part is this third column is million okay now this is here it has three places now this we have discussed the periods one period thousand period and million period now one period has three places okay what are those ones tens hundred same as indian place value chart thousand here is a little change in indian system we have only thousand and ten thousand whereas in international this also has three places that is 1000 10000 and the other is 100000 okay now come millions this also has three places that is million 10 million 100 million so here you will see children in international place value system each period has been divided into divided into three parts or you may say each period has three places once has one stands 100 thousands has 1000 10000 100000 millions has million 10 million 100 million okay so here you will see tens 10 10 common 100 Hundred, hundred, common. So here everywhere, tens place is there and hundred place is there. And when we proceed from right to left, you will see it is the multiple of ten. If this is one, then one into ten, ten that is tens. Again into ten hundred. Again into ten thousand. Again into ten ten thousand. Again into ten hundred thousand. Again into ten million. Again that ten million and then hundred million. So here each period contains three places. Okay. Now comes the place value. So here as I said, it is one. It is ten. It is hundred. This is thousand. This is ten thousand. One stands hundred thousand, ten thousand. Then this is hundred thousand. Then this is million. Then it is ten million, hundred million. Okay. Now we have studied that we mark the larger number or any greater number according to their period in Indian place value chart. Similarly, here this period contains 
three places that is once tens hundred okay so till ten thousand or we will not put comma as soon as the number start becoming larger and larger we start put, putting comma so we will put from here once tens hundred put a comma here if you go for here also it's okay so once tens hundred thousand ten thousand they are in the same period so they will be together once tens hundred thousand ten thousand hundred thousand they are together once tens hundred thousand ten thousand hundred thousand then one million once tens hundred thousand ten thousand hundred thousand million ten million again once tens hundred thousand ten thousand hundred thousand million ten million hundred million so here every period has hundred place and tens place okay so these this is the value of all these places now here i have taken an example and how are we going to put this this is because we are learning eight digit number so i have taken an example of eight digit number and now let's put this large number just under the or just below the correct value uh, their correct place okay so this is ones tens hundred thousand ten thousand hundred thousand million ten million so this will be three here six tens five hundreds two thousand zero ten thousand four hundred thousand seven million and eight ten million okay now according to their period let us put comma here here i have not put earlier i have not put comma according to the period or in other way we can say that i have not marked this large number according to its period so ones tens hundred so after ones tens hundred comma now this period what does it contain thousand ten thousand hundred thousand thousand ten thousand hundred thousand and then it's million 10 million so it is of the same i mean uh, period so it will be together for 100 million there will be one more digit comes so then it will become nine digit number so in the international place value chart when we mark the period it is easy to remember every period has three three places so you can mark but in indian how does it happen in indian this is common but here it, no hundred thousand visa it has only two place it has only two place but there is no million okay so this is the difference but this is easier to learn now let us see how are we going to name again we will repeat the same thing okay like uh, first the number name then we will write it in standard form then we will write it in the compact form then its successor its predecessor ascending order descending order the same way we will go so let's take another example of that okay so i hope this, this much is clear to you so now let's go for go for another example or we can continue with this a matter so first let us uh, let me take this 8 7 4 0 2 5 6 3 so let's name this number i mean write in words so how much it is first we will write this 87 87 and how much is that which uh, uh, period does it belong this is one period this is hundred uh, thousand period sorry one period thousand periods and million period so 87 million here we will put according to the period million okay here we can also put while writing in words also you can put comma 402,000. First, you will write this number. It is 402. And then what is its period? 1000. So, it will be 400. Thousand 
then 563 so 563 And then what is its period? Its period is once. So once is never, it's never, uh, once is never mentioned. So let's see again. It is 87. What is the period? Million. 87 million, 402. First you write this number. 402. And which period does it belong? It belongs to thousands period. So 402,000. 563 563 and one more thing children you always remember while writing the number name we never add s if you write 87 millions 402 thousands 563 it will be wrong. No S added when we write the number name. S comes when we write its place. Okay. So writing its place, the successor and predecessor that we will study tomorrow in our next class. I will give few more example of that and today a few words I will give you. Uh, um, to, uh, to write in words a few numerals I will give you to write it in words and practice its number name and tomorrow we will come up with a few examples of, of successor, predecessor then expanded form and then its uh, standard form ok so we will be practicing that and we will also compare those things along with the Indian list, okay, between Indian and international place value chart. So, I hope this is clear. Now, your work is to go through it again and again and just recall in your mind what is the period, what is place, what is place value. There only uh, great confusion is there. Whenever the period is asked, you children write the place of that number. If I ask, uh, ma write the period of the digit 5. So what do the children write? They write 100. 100 is, is its place. 100 is not its period. 5, 6 and 3, they all these 3 digits, they lie in one period. So, the period of 5 is uh, once, the period of 2 is thousands, period of 0 is thousands, period of 4 is thousands, period of 7 is millions, period of 8 is millions. So, this kind of question can be asked that mark the period of the underlying digit. Suppose I marked here and I ask you uh, uh, write the period of the digit underlying digit. So, which digit is underlined? 6 is underlined. So, what is its period? Its period is 1s. Then ma mark the or write the place of the digit, underlying digit. So, what is the place of 6? 10s. And write the place value of 6. What is this place value? 6 tenths. 6 tenths is equal to 60. So, its period is 1s. Its place is tenths. And its place value is 60. So, the assignment which we will be getting a worksheet today with this. In there, I will give you the question where I will mark certain digits. Or I will underline it and you have to mention its place period and um, place value okay i hope it's clear to all of you so please go through it again and again and revise it okay thank you